Welcome to Not Video Book Reviews. Today we're going to be reviewing a book called The Druid's Primer. Uh, the book's author is Luke Eastwood. It was published by Moon Books and it's copyrighted to 2012, so it's a recent book. Uh, let me read you what the back of the book says. Uh, the Druid's Primer is a comprehensive guide to genuine Druidic knowledge and practice based on ancient texts and surviving Celtic lore and customs. It is perhaps the first serious attempt to collate the vast body of Druidic knowledge from verifiable ancient sources and Celtic survivals into one usable and practical volume and operates as a handy reference for Druids and a learning tool for the would-be Druid. The Druid's primer inspired by the medieval Irish scholar's primer is the culmination of 15 years research and practical exploration of what it means to be a Druid in the modern context. This is the book. It has a foreword by Philip Cargom. Uh, it's been a while since I've read a new new Druidry book, so um, and I tend to stay away from them just to be clear. But a lot of my friends went gaga over this book, so out of their recommendations I decided to go ahead and read it. And I'm glad I did. Uh, this is certainly an interesting book to read. It's, um, it's a very informative work. It talks a lot about a lot of aspects of Druidry from cosmology to gods and goddesses to divination and uh, I've seen a lot of reviews of this book as well as blurbs uh, saying that it's a distinctly Irish in flavor and that's not exactly true. It does have a lot of Irish material I'll give you that, but it also has some Welsh material in it. Um, it has Welsh concepts like the Three Realms and the Owen um, and Welsh feast names. I think my favorite chapters in the book were the ones at the end which talked about divination and Ogham. Uh, I think the, the author really did a good job in um, explaining them and um, I guess I would recommend this book to anyone who's starting out because it does have a historical basis it does talk about sources, it does talk about um, mythology and it does a very good job of giving you a stepping stone uh, to go look for more sources to develop your own path and style um, it's also something of a reminder to people who've been on the path for a very long time but find themselves in a, um, a stagnant place and want to revive some stuff. Um, my friend Lauren has a review of this book up on her blog which I highly recommend you read so I'm gonna put the link to that in the notes for this episode. I hope you enjoyed this review and I hope to see you next time for another book review.